Ariel Hawani in Houston for UFC 247 alongside Alir Latifi, who meets Derek Lewis this Saturday Night Live on ESPN Plus pay-per-view. Alir, good to see you, my friend. And it's a new you, new year, new you, heavyweight Alir. Why did you make this decision? Well, you know, I started my career in heavyweight, and um, my first two, three fights were in heavyweight. And uh, after that, I did 205 for a while, you know, but um, with time, you put on more weight, more muscle, and, you know, the, la the latest weight cups, I was just seeing, like, I was doing the same training, but, but nothing was happening, you know, and the weight cuts got harder and harder, and uh, with time, I think all fighters go up one weight later, even in MMA or boxing or whatever, so it was just uh, a natural step in, in, uh, in the progress, you know. So the, the weight cuts, the last couple ones, they were tough? Yeah, yeah. I was like... Uh, I walk around at 240, 245, so I was cutting like a lot of weight, and, uh, and it took a toll on the body, you know. How much do you expect to weigh tomorrow morning? Honestly, <laughs> I haven't checked my weight in like two months. I haven't even gone to the scale. No, no, I, honestly. So I've just been training. I haven't like been eating crazy, but just training good, trying to eat healthy, but not restricting like my diet too much just feeling good, you know, and, and training. So, yeah, uh, it's a different experience being at camp, you know, uh, preparing for a fight like this uh, in a good way. And other things, like, you have to think, you know, now you're fighting real real big guys uh, with a lot of power. But what if you're over 265? Don't you want to know how much you weigh? I don't think I'm over you know, 260. Yeah. Will you check it at least once before the weigh-ins? <laughs> Maybe I should, man. That yeah. was a good... That was, <laughs> I don't think I'm that big, but... Uh, what do you think you'll be around, approximate? Uh, 245. Okay. Wow. Yeah. That's big. Yeah. That, that's my natural size, you know. And it was so funny because always people before say, why you don't go 185? I'm like, how the hell am, am yeah. I going to do 185? I'm like, it's just my, my natural way of being, you know. I'm very dense and heavy, so, uh, yeah, I can't help it. Has this been a much more enjoyable fight camp for you because you don't have to worry at all like you're not even stepping on the scale let alone worrying about your 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 food and all that yeah of course i mean um, a lot of the, the 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 thoughts about how the weight cut is gonna go is not there so that's been enjoyable you know uh, but you know the preparation is has been uh, tough you know i'm preparing for one of the best guys in the heavyweight division you know and it's a big challenge that i was looking forward to were you happy when you got him? Like maybe, did you think that you would get someone lower ranked to build yourself up at heavyweight? To be honest, I think all the fighters in the UFC are great fighters, you know, top athletes. So uh, even though you meet somebody who has his first fight or somebody who's been there and long, they're all good fighters, you know. Uh, I, got, I got the opportunity to fight De Derek, who's a top five fighter in the heavyweight division. And, you know, it's just like a great opportunity, a tough challenge, of course, you know, there, there's no easy fights, but uh, I, I looked forward for it. And so now you, you beat Derek, top five guy, all of a sudden, you don't have to work your way up, right? You're, you're right in the mix. That's the beauty of it. Yeah, that, that's, that's the good part of it, yeah, for sure. Is he a guy that when, when you were fighting at light heavyweight, you thought one day, you know, if I move up, this is someone that I would like to fight? Honestly, it's like, my thought about it was like more, you know, just a cool matchup. One of the smallest guys in yeah. 205 yeah. goes up to heavyweight, who's even smaller, and fights one of the biggest guys. And that's a little bit what, what uh, the sport was from the beginning, you know. You were seeing small guys fighting big guys, and I was just thinking, like, it would be a pretty crazy matchup, you know. Every fight in the UFC is important. They're all sort of do or die. But considering how the last two went, do you feel like this is a must win? Are you fighting for your job on Saturday? Uh, you know, every time you fight is, is the most important fight. So I'm just focusing on winning tomorrow, you know. And uh, after that, you know, I'll just take it from there. All right. Good luck to you, my friend. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks. And please check your weight just for my own anxiety, okay? I will. All right, I <laughs> Hello everyone, it's Ariel Hawani. I just came here to thank you for watching our ESPN YouTube channel. It's the best. You know what else is the best? The ESPN app. You can get highlights, analysis, all that stuff and more. And if you want premium content and live streaming sports, there's only one place for all of that. It's ESPN+. Plus.